Hello, this is Michelle Knight, and this is the astrological update for the week starting the 29th of June. This week, we have a full moon, and this full moon is stirring us, and all of our unconscious desires are coming to the surface. On top of that, if you include Eris, we have a pentagram. Pentagrams are about the deepest magic and transformation. Here's your weekly astrology. How do you say? Something good at long last And we're away Libra, the full moon is shining a light, it's magical moonlight on your home and family. Look out for deep insights, dreams, signs, symbols on something very important connected to your home or family. You're also feeling very nurturing, like you want to look after people, like you need intimate time with those that you love, cozying up, doing lovely homey things. So if there's any chance for you to get on and do that this week, it's great. You also may have a real insight into some problem connected to a family member and you may be feeling very nurturing and helpful this week. The other big news of this week is there is a pentagram and a pentagram's a very intense soulful experiences. Yeah, and I, this is the year of the pentagram. It's a year that, you know, last year was all about the grand crosses and all that, in, you know, quite tough stuff. Now, this year is about transforming on a, not only a, a, a human level, but a soul and spiritual level. And for you, Venus, your ruler and Jupiter are conjunct in your position of A, the language I would use, connected with the fact of the one consciousness or connected to your part of the one consciousness or to put it another way, knowing why you're here, feeling your connection to being here in this lifetime right now. And also you may find a group of people or even a dream you've cast out to the universe unexpectedly comes to you because Jupiter is the planet of good fortune and it's sitting right next to Venus, the planet of love. Now we do have Uranus and Eris, the warrior goddess, conjunct also in your position of relationships. So there may be some issue connected to anger in a relationship or connected to the way you or your partner, if you're in a relationship, express anger. If you're single, you may, might meet someone who's very feisty out of the blue. But whatever it is, because it's a pentagram, we have the opportunity to transform it, heal it and turn it into something else. Along with that, you're making a commitment to making yourself feel secure and possibly even doing something new financially. Well, this pentagram will bring a little bit of magic to you in that direction. Exciting stuff. Take care and I'll speak to you soon. Let's go far today and it's all gonna be wonderful. Oh, let's run away and I know where we are going to. I hope you enjoyed this and if you did, it would be great if you could subscribe to my channel or share. And also, if you want more written and in-depth free astrology and films, go to my website, horoscope.co.uk. Oh.